Soon after my exoneration, my story um, was released through, I mean, a number of different outlets. And it started to stretch across the country and even places around the world. Somebody put out something that was saying, this story is, is like a movie. Watching the film is still, I mean, it's still fresh. You know, when I see it, I'm literally uh, reliving it in my head. But it's necessary. I really feel like this film is necessary. Right after I was exonerated, like I think it was the following day, my phone rang and I pick up the phone, this guy is like, hey, uh, I'm looking for a linebacker, you know, I can find one. And I'm like, yeah, man, you got the right number. Who is this? And he's like, it's me, man, Coach Carroll. And I just thought it was amazing, man, that we had went from this whole recruiting dance back in high school and when he was at USC to coach there to us now, uh, me being an exoneree and someone who has spent, you know, 10 years of life, uh, you know, in, in, in confinement. And, and he heard my story and took interest in it and, you know, remembered who I was. And, I mean, at that time, it was, it was one of the greatest uh, achievements for me uh, past getting my life back and getting my name cleared, finally recapturing the dream that was taken away which was to play football, which was to just have an opportunity to play at the highest level. And that opportunity came from him. The players, the coaches, the staff, um, everybody treated me like family, as if we had already known each other for years. I think that's what probably ca like captivated me and, and, and grabbed me more than anything else, was just the instant uh, brotherhood that just came with the Seattle Seahawks and to try out, to give it in my all, to know that it came, the opportunity came from Pete Carroll, somebody who, who saw potential in me as a high school player and then allowed me to, to, to see if it was still there. And, you know, coming back after all of this, um, greatest, one of the greatest experiences ever, ever, man, was coming here and trying out for the Seahawks.